Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the 26th. So keep in mind that the timing is fluid, right? These readings are timeless. Bits and pieces of this reading might be for you, the whole reading might be for you, or perhaps this reading will resonate in a couple days or something like that. But I'm going to intend it to be whenever it's meant for you. <laughs> so let's see what we got. Well, what do we have for a message today? For around the 26. We'll go ahead and say that, okay? Just to make everybody happy. What do we have for around the 26? fortune reversed now this is a setback this is a step backwards this is bad news bad luck bad timing oh, there it is Ooh, knight of swords queen of wands reversed let's just make sure there's no more so, Knight of Swords, Queen of, we have somebody here who's not healthy. They're not healthy. They lack self-esteem. They may be very fearful, but this is fearless. So, this is interesting. This is this is rushing out of control. We have somebody here that, and this could this could be a loss. I am gonna tell you right away. Okay, the Wheel of Fortune reversed is definitely not good news. Put it that way. Um, could be dealing with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. This is in a hurry. We have somebody here that is on a mission. They are doing something. They got some sort of idea. They have to do it. It's not positive. Whatever they're doing is not the right thing. Okay? No, they're not doing the right thing. It's not good news. All right? Um... <clears throat> We have this now somebody could be throwing a fit they could be acting out of anger this is somebody that is self-righteous maybe even revengeful okay the queen of wands in reverse is somebody that is unhealthy very very controlling maybe melodramatic that is somebody this person is on a mission this could be a sudden arrival. This person suddenly appears. <clears throat> this is this is something that is unpredictable. This is an unpredictable entrance of some sort. This person cannot master their emotions. Eight of Pentacles. Now that is putting in a lot of effort. Following a plan. Somebody has made a plan. This is a there's a plan here. We got somebody here that has made a plan. It's not a good plan. Just so you know. This is like a scheme of some sort. Hmm. They're speeding as well. This person is speeding. They're in a hurry. Um, this is definitely clinging to control. We have somebody here that is clinging to control. They want to be in control. They're going to do whatever it takes to gain control. This person is overly proud, self-righteous, doesn't want to lose This is, this is a negative, repetitive pattern. We have somebody here that just can't... Uh, be positive. This person isn't positive. They're, they're very clingy, very dramatic, which is interesting. So, ten of unstable. 
Ten of Pentacles reversed. Whoever this person is, they are very unstable. They may do things illegally. They probably are financially unstable. They may be stay unstable with their mindset. This is there, there could be a family fight here. This could be a family member. It doesn't have to be. This is uh, definitely an unstable home life or an unstable business. This person may uh, have a self-image problem. They have something to prove. There's a lot of insecurity here. So we have a very insecure person that is very unstable at this time. They have an un unstable living environment. They're planning on doing something. They are. They're planning. They're trying very, very hard to get what they want. This is definitely somebody who wants to get their way. Okay. And they've got some sort of idea or plan. Okay, because this is a plan. I can see that it's a plan. They've got some sort of idea that they have to do something, but it's not good. Oh, man, what is this? What is this? What is this? Wheel of Fortune reversed. Oh, good. Ace of Pentacles. Now, this Ace of Pentacles is something you can touch. This is reality. This is about stability. And we talked about it in the one that I did this morning. This is a gift. They may be coming with some sort of gift, but I'd be careful. <laughs> I would be. That Wheel of Fortune reversed is not good. Okay. Um, this is a reality check. They are coming to uh, with their plan because this is planning. Which is interesting. This wheel of fortune. Somebody has manifested, or they're planned. They've they 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 have planned something. They've planned to give somebody a reality check. They've planned to give somebody a reality check. That's fun. All right. So hmm. This is a golden opportunity. This is a new opportunity. I mean. Huh. Six of, they aren't going to be successful. There's lack of success here. Six, this is a fail. Six of wands reversed. This is a failure. The six of wands reversed is somebody that is disgraced. Now the six of wands reversed right underneath the wheel of fortune reverse is a setback. We have an individual that is disgraced. They are embarrassed. This person has an overinflated ego. They don't like to lose, which I saw up here. So I feel like this person has lost something and they want it back. They want the power back, right? They want the control back. This person is all show. They're all show. There's definitely some unwelcome news coming with that Six of Wands reverse. It is. This news that is coming will be a reality check. It will definitely be a reality check. The The Wheel of Fortune reverse can be a horrendous uh, uh, loss, right? This is somebody's past mistakes coming back to haunt them because they keep repeating the same negative patterns. Somebody isn't learning from their mistakes. And they're staying stuck. They're staying in the present. They're refusing to let go of their old life, per se, when they have a golden opportunity, but their ego is inflated. Their ego is huge. You know, they, they can't get past. They can't accept and cut their losses. Put it that way. This is somebody that is very smug, very cocky, very prideful. Whoever this person is that is entering, this is an entrance. It is. There is an arrival. This person could be showing up. But I feel like they're going to be stopped. They may try, but they, it feels like they're not going to be. They're not going to be successful. It's like they're on their way, but they don't make it. This is a stop, and this is a stop. They may be stopped. So somebody may be stopped. It's like they're on their way. They're on a mission. They got something to say. Or they're going to reenact their freaking plan or whatever it is. But 
<laughs> so, yeah, they're coming. Six of Swords. That is going for a ride. Somebody may be going for a ride. They're going someplace. That's for damn sure. Anyhow, Six of Swords. Now, the Six of Swords is usually uh, leaving some sort of trouble behind. Going to a better place. Somebody may be going to a... This is, you know, I did a reading this morning. This sounds very familiar. This is going to a better place. Leaving the... Uh, rough rot waters behind, right? We have somebody here that has been unsuccessful. They have a new opportunity. After a setback, after a fall or something like that. This person is in a hurry. They're speeding. Something is happening. This is like going way too fast. And this one is... Uh, unrealistic the queen of wands in reverse i mean that's somebody that is uh, upset definitely somebody that is upset melodramatic right does not like to lose at all now this is about putting in work moving towards something new because we're now we're going back this way somebody is moving towards uh rebuilding stability this is just the same kind of reading as this morning <laughs> ah it really is this is a replay it's just different cars different places so there is definitely a higher power involved here um could be dealing with a taurus doesn't have to be this is a card of faith it's a card of believing in oneself there's a higher power involved here Now, this is a channeler. This is somebody that has a direct connection with God. This is a higher power. This is access to God of some sort. We have somebody here that, in the home, this, this is a counselor or a mentor or a teacher or somebody that is, somebody is moving towards I don't know what's going on here. They're moving towards some sort of... Maybe it's counseling. I don't know. It feels like the authorities could get involved. Government, maybe some sort of authorities could get involved. Which is interesting. There's some sort of guidance here. Somebody is being guided. They are. They're being guided in a different direction after they fail. They failed to follow through with the plan that they created. They were. It's almost like they were planning to do something crazy. But they get stopped. Now this Hierophant is somebody that praise right believes maybe has manifested something but this is short-lived success whoever this person is very unstable now this high this 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 hair font sees the lack of stability the higher power sees or whoever this person is sees the lack of stability they see the struggle They see the instability, so they're, it's like, this is, it's time to go, it's time to move on, it's time to go to a better place. So, things are, I mean, this is, uh, I don't know, that, that Knight of Swords, somebody's taking action, they're moving very, very fast, it's like it's out of control, and it is definitely out of control, this person is out of control. So whoever this person is, they're out of control. And they, I, mean, I don't know what's going on, but that first card out was a Wheel of Fortune reverse. That is a shocking, unpredictable loss because somebody is out of control. Now they're going somewhere. They fail at their plan. 
They do fail at their plan. They're about to get a real sore if I stop myself. A reality check. This person, um, loses. They lose. They are not successful with their plan. Six of Cups. Six of Cups is about memories, nostalgia, remembrance. Memories of love, the past, something about children and family and home. So, the, you know, maybe this person is angry over their past. We see where it is. They're angry over their home life. They're angry over their childhood. Something like that. And that is why they are reacting in the way that they are. Six, six, six. Six, six, six. It's time to get your life back on track. It's time for a reevaluation. The sixes are about the journey to balance and harmony. This is a spiritual wake up call. This is a spiritual wake up call. I know I'm repeating myself because I like to do that. Somebody is going to be, like I said this morning, driven. They're, if it was like they're going to be driven, they're going to be taken, whatever that means, I don't know, to a better place. I do feel like there is an unpredictable loss here. That first card out. This is bad luck. We have this person has had a run of bad luck. But their attitude has brought it upon themselves. Their entitlement. I'm entitled. Nobody is entitled to anything. That is a mindset. Nobody owes another person anything. Unless it's a job. That you get paid for. Anyhow, um, anyway, we have an individual that feels as though they are entitled. They feel as though they have lost. And it feels like they're hysterical. They can't master their emotions at all. They're very insecure. They're remembering their pa the past. They're basing their emotions on the past and they're reacting to the past. They've come up with some sort of plan. I feel like this plan is not a good plan, just so you say, just so you know. Their plan is not going to be successful because they're going to they're going to uh, this is a fall of some sort. The wheel of the wheel of fortune reverse. This is an unfortunate loss. Okay? An unfortunate setback. They're going to be stopped. They're going to be stopped somehow. There's a higher power involved here. There could be some sort of... This could be protection. It absolutely could be protection. Now, the Six of Wands reverse. This is a loser. Talked about this before. This loser that has no... Uh, desire to uh, try is probably going to experience something I don't know 
what the hell it is though what is it what is it that they are going to experience ace of wands reversed ace of wands reversed is <sighs> fall of some sort no desire going south not coming to fruition whatever it is that they were planning it's not going to happen it's not going to materialize they're going to lose their fire you know they're going to give up they're not or something's going to happen they're just not going to make it it's going to it's like they get it doesn't it's like when the match goes out before you got all the candles lit They just don't have the drive to succeed. This person doesn't have the drive to succeed. Therefore, they're not going to be successful with whatever it is that they plan on doing. It's like they, they have this moment of sudden spark or sudden desire and they fizzles out really fast. They get stopped. That's what I want to say. They get stopped. Um, we have something to do with the Queen of Pentacles here because I've seen it twice while I was talking to you. So we may have, there may be a, be a Queen of Pentacles here, a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is somebody that is very motherly, abundant, disciplined, stable. Hard working. And that Eight of Pentacles is hard working. Somebody may be uh, I don't know what it is, but it feels it could be de dealing I don't know. I don't know what it is. What the hell is that Queen of Pentacles? I don't know. We have this uh, mastermind here who has come up with a plan to take down this Queen of Pentacles, that's exactly what it is. Oh my God. <clears throat> so this could be a disaster, it could be an accident, they don't make it. This could also be a delay. Some, and that, 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 that Wheel of Fortune it reverses a delay as well. So there is going, somebody's going to be stopped. They may have some sort of plan to take, because this is taking down somebody, I believe. Anyhow, the Six of Swords is going, going, moving on, moving on from something that isn't growing. Somebody isn't growing. They aren't, uh, they shouldn't be doing what they're doing. Put it that way. This person has no real get up and go. They do for a minute, but it fades really fast. Anyhow, um, so it feels like this person doesn't make it. It's like they're on some sort of mission. It's not a good mission. And they don't make it. They don't make it. Definitely very similar to the reading I did this morning. I guess that is the message. It's the same message. There could be some memories that come up. There could be. There could be some memories. I mean, you know, what happens when memories come up? Memories come up after loss. I think we're dealing with somebody that is disgraced. They're embarrassed. They act out of revenge. 
and they get stopped in their tracks. There's a higher power involved. Working behind the scenes. Good luck.